So what I said was Thank you for tuning into this video. My name is Nicholas Adab and today I'm going to be sharing with you five tips on how to make your videos better with sound, which is what I said just now. Tip one, audible dialogue. From a vlog all the way until a movie, someone is saying something at some time somewhere. And if you can't hear anything that they're saying, how are you going to tell the audience what they are trying to convey? Especially if we can't hear anything that they're saying. So what we want to do is always make the voices stand out in the mix. Unless of course you're trying to be creative with it, then up to you. I always like to go back to my reference example. Will you watch a five hour speech muted? <clears throat> Of course not, so that's why get good audio. So examples of how you can capture good audio very briefly, you can get a mic and point it to yourself. Don't have a mic, use an earpiece and record with your phone. Lastly, if you're shooting a film at the beach and the voice that you captured was totally unusable, that is when you're going into ADR. So what it means by that is to re-record the lines in a controlled environment, then sync it up to the video. To do that, it takes a lot of effort, but Hollywood does it, so... Why can't you? Tip two, choosing the right music. I'm not gonna talk about the copyright stuff, how to legalize the music to be used. Uh, my direct answer to that would be Epidemic Sound and Artlist. These websites get rid of all that problem so you can just focus more on making the video itself. Music gives your audience a direction to feel. What we have next are examples of the same shot with different pieces of music and see how you feel. I don't really have an answer to this because it's very subjective to what different kinds of films you guys are doing. But one example I can think of is don't use slow transitions with EDM music, especially in travel vlogs. It, it's just, it just doesn't fit, all right? One, two, three. Please cut faster. Thank you. Tip number three, mix with audio meters and not your computer's volume. So I saw someone do this, which is why I thought of this tip. It's very basic, but everyone makes mistakes. After watching this, please improve. So what you wanna do is keep your headphones or speakers at a constant level for your whole edit. So the mistake I saw was when the clip was too soft, the person would raise the volume of the computer. Then when they export, they wonder why it's so soft. This is because they didn't raise the audio gain of the clip itself, but the overall computer. So what you want to do is follow your audio meters in your NLE. That way you can understand if your audio is too loud or too soft. I hope I got that point across. This is something that the very beginners don't know yet. Tip four, synchronization of audio. If you recorded audio and video separately, Clap to make a sync point, so in post, it'll be way easier to sync them together. So what you can do in Premiere is to zoom in all the way in your timeline. Then what you want to do is slowly move the recorded audio until it matches with the reference camera audio. So another way which will be much easier is to highlight both the audio capture with the reference clip, right click and click synchronize and boom, synchronize. Tip five. Foley. I'm gonna make a longer video on this, but to share a little, it's the addition of recorded sounds after the shooting of a film. Foley adds immersion. Like you will be surprised what you can use to recreate sounds. Most of the sounds aren't even recorded on site. For example, horse hooves, bells, wind, bones cracking, focusing just on the rain. You gotta be creative with your sound. So those are concepts on how you can use Foley in your videos. Consider trying it out yourself. So those are my five tips on how you can make your videos better with sound. Next time we'll dive deeper into sound design other than that. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Nicholas Adopt and I hope to see you guys on the next adventure. Goodbye.